This is a continuation of the program by Jason Davies on keeping it simple using the KY040 rotary encoder and Mr. Klein's extension for that in microbit using the make code microbit. In this case, I've got the encoder right here. It has a push button and a, a uh, rotating dial. As I rotate it, it turns on, according to this program, an LED light. I rotate it another notch, and that red light goes off and the blue light comes on. Another notch, blue goes off, yellow comes on. Another notch, yellow goes off, and green comes on. By pressing the button on the encoder, it turns off all the, the remaining light, and then you can go through the process again. I've got a... USB cable with uh, tape on it because this cable is a power cable only. Keep that in mind. There are USB cables that you think will download data, but in fact they're power only. I'm going to put a link to this program in the description of this video. I've had to turn off first on Start LED enable turn it off because if you don't do that then when you plug in your LED lights there'll be some voltage that dribbles through to some of these pin numbers. What that means is you can't see the progression of these LED lights on the micro bit display because they're turned off. If you switch this from false to true, then pull this block in forever. Now the LEDs will not really function properly, but you will be able to see the progression of this light across the array on the micro bit. This array right here will show lights with the configuration that I have now. So you can test that yourself. I'll upload this video now with a link to the uh, code.